Jitex 2016 down here right now for Jitex Live in the New Zabil Halls uh, by the Startup uh, Movement Tech Talk area and uh, really pleased to be joined by uh, Vu Van from, uh, from Elsa. Very good to have you here. It's very great to be here as well. First of all, give me some background to your business. So Elsa is an artificial intelligence that helps all of the language learners in improving their pronunciation as they learn to speak English using our proprietary speech recognition technology. Uh, so obviously we're here in the startup area. Uh, you've been doing some uh, keynote speeches and some addressing. How have you found those sessions? It was really inspiring. I think we had really good audience here, very good questions. And after the keynote speaking, I got approached by a lot of people who are interested about the solution, what we can do for the Middle East. Uh, can we teach Arabic using ELSA technology in addition to English? And the answer is yes. So it's just a more matter of like future collaboration. And I think it opens up a lot of doors for us in the future. Over the last three months, our user space in the Middle East has grown very fast and it's all organic and that led us to believe that there's a big need here for the language learning solution. So we want to start building local team here and this is opening a very good door for us to get access to talents, know who's playing what in this industry as well as who to contact in the future. So I think it's good. Uh, and this year, of course, the uh, the uh, the very first startup movement for Jitex. Uh, obviously, you're a startup. What uh, what advice would you give to any prospective startups watching this right now? Build your startup only when you have a big passion, when you care so much about something that you want to solve, either it's for yourself or for somebody else. We had some of the younger participants here coming and ask me, should they do a startup? For me, you don't start a startup just because that's a trend. Just because everybody else doing it doesn't mean you have to do it. But you should do it when you actually found your passion and your calling in life and you want to solve that problem for yourself and for others. Fantastic. Uh, Vu, thank you. A pleasure to meet you and thanks for your insight. Thank you so much for your time.